Hey everyone, I'm at North Atlanta High School where Passion City Church Cumberland has been gathering for almost a year and a half. It's in this place that we've seen God do the extraordinary already. People getting connected and plugged in, families getting connected, people serving and giving for the first time, but most amazingly, people going from death to life. Turning a high school into a place for us to have church doesn't happen on its own. It actually takes hundreds of people. Door holders start arriving at 5 a.m. here at North Atlanta High School. They unload multiple semi-trucks. They set up uh, sound, video, and lighting in the theater. They turn a cafeteria into bloom. We have the opportunity to turn a black box theater into a place for us to have passion kids. And what I love most about it is people don't do this because they have to. People do this because they want to. They want to make a place for the people in Atlanta to see and experience Jesus. And it's happening right here at Passion City Church Cumberland. When I come in, it's pretty early and it's pretty quiet, but there's already like the IT team here and they're setting up the computers. We get here, grab a cup of coffee, maybe some snacks, sit down, have some time together as community. We have experienced um, coming alive in Jesus at Passion City and we want other people to experience that. Someone once served my family when we, I was a small child and my mother wanted to go um, into the gathering to hear a message and someone watched my sister and I um, and I hope that I can do that for a family and know that you know this might be the only time that a parent gets to experience Jesus. What we're seeing and experiencing here at Passion City Church Cumberland is largely due to the generosity of people ahead of us. Not generations, but just in the last few years that we've talked about and believed for the miracle of Cumberland, we're actually standing in it, seeing it, experiencing, watching lives transform before our eyes. And the beautiful opportunity that we have now is that we get to make a place for people ahead of us. We love North Atlanta High School. We love our partnership. We love the opportunity we have to get to meet here. But ultimately, this is not our home. We are creating a place. We're making a place on 10 acres of land that we already own. We're already uh, retrofitting a building and planning to break ground on a new building for us to get to meet there on a week after week basis. Why? Because we wanna make a place for more people to experience Jesus. I was looking for a new home and I've definitely found it. Our prayer for the city of Atlanta is that they would feel the love of Jesus through Passion City Church. My hope for someone else coming to visit Passion City Church is that they know that they belong here no matter what they're coming in with. I would pray for this city that they would see through us, through our relationship, through our family, through this family here, that they would see Jesus. We are transformed every Sunday that we come here and we have a gift that is in us and we get to bring that to the city, to our coworkers, to our friends, to our communities, and that is life changing. God is already answering our prayers. I think about the family that got invited to North Atlanta High School on Easter Sunday and they came, they loved it, they felt like they were home and now they're connected into our house. In fact, Passion City Church is home for them. They haven't been to any other locations but the Cumberland location. Or I think about the, the single mom and her, and her daughter who live in the apartment complex right around the corner and when they came in they said, wow, this is a church and a high school and they felt like they were home. Or I think about the man that just a few weeks ago walked into North Atlanta High School and he told me he was at the bottom of his pit in life. And he walked out putting his faith in Jesus and saying that he had hope on the horizon for the very first time. It's these stories and countless more like them that fuels us to continue to lead into the above so we can trust God for the beyond.